Hi everyone, my name is Christine. Welcome back to my channel. Ta -da! Tomorrow is another day, but today, today is another video tutorial. <laughs> no, God! Our topic for today is how to verify your identification in Google AdSense or AdSense Identity Verification. So after so many struggles, like you have to reach the 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hour before you get monetized on your YouTube channel. And then after that, you need to reach the $10 threshold before the Google AdSense will send you an email for identity verification or address verification. And if you guys didn't verify your identity, Google AdSense will notify you and your ads will stop running on your YouTube channel or on your videos. So guys, verify your address or verify your identity. So stay with me guys. I will make it quick and easy steps for you again guys. If you are facing this problem on your identity verification, especially to the new content creator like me who have done 3 times to 5 times submitting your proof of identity, this video and tips will surely helpful for you. What are the acceptable forms of IDs for Google AdSense identity verification? You have to submit government-issued ID card, the bank statement, telephone bill, and rent receipt. In my case, I did submit my proof of identity which is my passport and a phone bill with my address on it. But unfortunately, they did not accept it again. What are the IDs that I submitted why Google AdSense did not accept my IDs? First ID is my employment card. Second ID is my passport. Third, I tried my employment ID plus my passport. And lastly, my passport and my phone bill. Unfortunately, all attempts gone wrong and Google AdSense did not accept my IDs. Once again, Google AdSense emailed me to verify my address and my identity. Sometimes, Google AdSense were unable to verify from the documents you provide. For example, if your documents are blurry or unreadable or your government ID doesn't have your address and signature on it. If this happens, Google AdSense will invite you to resubmit. This is my tips. So based on my experience, if you do not have any government IDs that has address and signature on it, and if you don't want to hassle more about this, after first attempt to four attempts, all you need to do is use your parents, spouse, or relatives ID card with their address on it and signature on the ID card. Because that is what Google AdSense exactly asking you to submit. And yes, I only have one attempt left, so this is what I did. Okay, just go to your browser, search the Google AdSense Earn Money From Website Monetization. Just sign in, click the payments, click the verification check, then click the verify now. So this is my last attempt for my identity verification. Unfortunately, it didn't go through again. Reasons, the documents you previously submitted had the following problems. The documents was issued by a country that is not accepted, which is my passport. And the document could not be verified. Okay, let's try again for the last time. But this time, I'm going to use my spouse government ID card, which is the driver's license. Just click upload document. Choose the government ID that you want to upload. Just make sure that the government ID that you are going to submit is not blurry and readable. And then click next. And now you will able to see your personal identity, your legal name, proof of identity document. And then just make sure you put the correct address. And guys, before you submit it, 
always double check your details. That's it guys. All you need to do is wait until Google AdSense will notify you if your document got verified. It may take hours or days, but mine, I received less than an hour. I got an email from Google AdSense and my identity verification successful. That was legitness. Yeah. Now let me sign in to my Google AdSense account and let's see and check my payments info and then verification check so this is it guys identity verification completed yeah. always remember if google adsense cannot verify your identity let's say if you have reached your limit use google adsense identity verification troubleshooter to find out what steps to take next and note that google adsense won't be able to remove the payment hold on your account until they have verified your identity so that's it for today again guys thank you for watching my video i always appreciate it and i hope this video will help you on your youtube journey and if you have any question guys don't hesitate just leave a comment and i will try to help you or i will try to answer your question as much as i can so thank you guys i appreciate you all please subscribe on my youtube channel give me a thumbs up if you like this video so have a great day again guys be safe out there and see you on my next video bye peace out